in a world of hardship, betrayal, loss, progress is still progress. There will always be a new challenge around the corner, that's never going to change. But as long as you're taking at least one step, that is always one step closer to achieving your goals. Little by little, as long as you persist, you will get there. So just remember, small progress is still progress. Welcome to the bushiest place on earth. Probably not the bushiest place on earth, actually. I take that back. But the bushiest place in my general area. Maybe. That, that could be incorrect information. Could be correct information. I don't know. See, brain isn't that big. Bit small, you know. Um, not very smart. So we're working with whatever percent of my brain. Or brain cells I've got left. I'm guessing I must have got dropped on my head once. You never know. Anything's possible. Just like what we're about to do today. Behind me here... Are trees. I know. Groundbreaking. Incredible. Breathtaking. Although I'm still breathing. That might be a fortunate or unfortunate thing. Depends on how you look on life. Positive or negative, you know what I mean? But today, I am going to be doing a little bit of construction. As I said in the last episode, and you haven't seen it, you should probably go watch it. You know what? Maybe go start at episode one. When you're watching the series, it's usually a good start. Well, you know, just stay and watch this one. Watch hours are cool. I'll take it either way. But we're going to be doing another little lean-to, and I've got something incredible. Some of you don't like it. Some of you do like it. The truth is, I don't know why, but everywhere I go only sells this one colored tarp. It's blue. Yes, indeed. I am back with a blue tarp. Oh, I get it. It doesn't blend in and looks ugly, but you know what, I don't care if it looks ugly, because I like it. And this is my build, so my opinion is what matters here. And maybe you guys too, I might let you in if I like your idea, but only if I like it. So comment down below any suggestions. But, of course, we've got our great tarp here. I like that. It's cool. What do you do with a tarp? You probably, you probably open it, you know. In the weirdest way possible, but we're opening it. Okay, so this is useless. We don't want that. I'll pick that up later. Um, come on. They're a bit hard to get out sometimes, you know. You've sometimes got to give them a little extra push. That works. So, you may be wondering, what now? Well, obviously, I'm going to put it up. I didn't just start this video to just... Hey, top. Goodbye. That is going to be a pain to ravel back up now. But that's fine. Because we... I'm going to put it somewhere here. Um, that might be a good starting point to figure out, if you ask me. You know, every good thing starts with a good idea. Or, in my case, a bad idea. Look. I'm not going to say it's going to look great, but the point here is, failure is always an option. When you're making stupid videos like this and can actually afford to fail, when it comes to school grades, that's a different story, and that is forbidden stuff. We don't go there. Now our best starting point is to um, probably figure out where to put this thing, usually. That is usually a pretty good start. in a day's work. And on one end here, and the other over there, somewhere.
unfortunately it is time to commit small amounts of deforestation. Don't worry, small amounts are healthy. Big amounts, not healthy. Keep that in mind, world leaders, because that might be useful information. But hey, I have no control, so you, I guess you guys do you. Time to hammer this in. Now this out of the way, we've got ourselves a lovely little bush tarp hideaway thing. For the most part, um, that back half might need some sorting out. But don't worry, I am the random person for the job, I guess. There is no one else here to do it, so I don't really have much of a choice. Oh well. How am I going to do it, you may ask? I don't know. Yeah, I really don't know. Should probably figure that part out. That might be a good place to go here, or a direction to take. Um, yeah, yeah, um, could be smart. Could be smart. Yeah, I got nothing. Actually, I got something. It's the random log that I had on the tree for a few episodes. Yeah, that's fun. Let's uh, do something with that. Maybe. We'll see how this goes. Well, small progress is still yet progress. Didn't think this part out. As you can see, there is a giant tree in the way. Something I did not take into account and will probably not be taking down because it's fat and long and big. And tree like. So let's figure this out, shall we? What are you looking at me for? You, you expect me to do something about it? You, you do? This would be really handy. If I just had an excavator, why can't I be like the Indians on YouTube? Why do I have to do it legit? Why do I care? Probably because I'd, I honestly, because you get backlash for not doing it legit. That's a pretty good reason, actually. Let's do this a legit way. Although I also just, I don't have the money for an excavator. I could barely afford this tarp, and it was five dollars. Who do you think I am, Mr. Money Man? I ain't Mr. Krabs. I'm Mr. Mr. Broke, Mr. Hobo. Should I just name my channel Mr. Hobo? It's probably the most accurate definition of where my life is heading. Horse flies everywhere, and they ain't horsing around. Hey, look, for the most part, it's functional. I never said I knew how to be functional. I don't count on that. I'm not leaving it here. I can get it to at least be like this. Just a little something to aid it. And I could use that tree that I snapped down earlier. So we will. Why am I so weak? Look at me, I'm a bone. I'm not. I'm just a skeleton. I am literally just a bone.
I do question myself sometimes. Maybe more than sometimes. Okay, so this whole thing may look kind of retarded, and I promise you, it is. But it works. And it's cozy. Just don't expect it to keep the rain out. Overall, I would like to say this could have gone a lot worse. Um, I was expecting a complete, utterly failed disaster, and no video to show for it, because it failed. But, overall... I think we've done alright. Oh, I'm no bushcraftsman. So I'll take what I can get and this, this is what I can get. It's what I'll get. So, yeah. That's our new addition to the camp. If you look at the camp, it is just next to each other. Not far at all. So, I've got to say, overall, it's alright. But I know you may be wondering. Um, didn't I say last episode I wanted every area of this place to have a purpose? Like the teepee, the shade tarp, the garden area, and this. Yes. Yes, I do. And I don't have a purpose for this yet. I just know I wanted it. Because I spent five bucks on it. So, yeah. So, as for what the purpose of this is going to be... Next episode, we're going to come in, we're going to redo the, not redo, but give the TP a purpose, and give this a purpose to existing, something I am yet to have. But if I can at least give this a purpose, maybe that might mean something for me. So, we'll get there, so do stay tuned, consider subscribing, you know, just, just saying, that might be pretty cool. And, let's get on to Jeffrey. Yeah, I love me some Jeffrey. Now, the final structure was 99% complete. I was quite happy with it, and slowly some ideas were cooking of what I could use this area for in its weird shape and design. Jeffrey time! Let's see if we can free him today. I feel like we didn't make much progress today. I feel like the deeper I get into this log, the less progress I do make. So I'm starting to question to myself, will Jeffrey ever be free? I guess only time and a little bit of subscribing will tell, you know what I'm saying? But hey, I guess this is the end for this episode, not forever. I'm not going anywhere, I think. I could die tomorrow, you don't know. But um, on a serious note, I tried to be a little bit more comedic with this episode. So, um, you know, let me know in the comments what worked, what didn't, you know, if you'd like to see more of this again, or I guess more of the serious tone. Mix of both. I'm trying out a few more cinematic type stuff lately, and I feel like I prefer the more cinematic approach than what I've tried here of this episode. Um, but if you guys would like to see me integrate a bit more of the just the random humour into that cinematic stuff, um, please do let me know, and yeah, I can definitely do that. But um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. We did make some progress on the Season 2 encampment. And we are nearing the end for this encampment. So, as I said, TP and... I don't even know what to call this other tent yet. Um, we'll come back to you in the next episode. For the time being, thank you guys for watching this one. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh wait, oh, hold on, sorry. Let's at least have a cinematic outro. And yet, as we come to a close today, little by little, I have made progress to slowly finishing this encampment. Today, we are just that one step closer. And by the next episode, we'll be yet another step closer.